All right, got this Amboynia Burl here all set up to do a barren fountain pen out of. This is going to be a gorgeous barren fountain pen in gold. We've got some nice Amboynia Burls. It's got some both gold and red Amboynia in it, so this is going to be a really pretty one. just happened crap well sometimes things happen with Amboynia Burl is my first failure in a while it does not feel good but uh, we will recover I'll, uh, I'll get some new blanks cut up here and then we'll get them re-glued my failure here was this right here it's not enough glue in there I forgot to roughen up the barrel before I glued it in Amateur mistake, but I did it, and so now I've got to go deal with it. All right, got the new Amboynia Burl blanks up here for this gold barren fountain pen, so let's get this going. All right, there we go. I'm going to get this sanded up, and then I will see you guys back when I'm ready for a CA finish. All right, just been cleaning up this Amboynia Burl blank with some denatured alcohol. Got it all polished up all the way through about 600 grit, and uh, just hit it with some denatured alcohol. Been doing this for probably about 10 minutes or so. It's had a lot of oil and stuff coming out of it, and so I've been letting it cool down, hit it with denatured alcohol. It's just about done seeping. So now we're ready for a CA finish. So just gonna get a little baggie on my finger here. Got a whole bunch of patches of just blue shop towels here to my side. Gonna be using glue boost like usual. It's one of my favorite CA glue finishes to use. Hit it with two coats of medium and then three coats of thin. We just turn it on, turn our speed all the way down, and rub it in. And then we hit it with our activator. Alright, we can get four more coats going on that. One more of medium and then three of thin. And this will be ready to get polished up and put together.
right. We are all ready to get this repolished up. So I'll see you guys as soon as we're ready to throw on some HUD Ultra Gloss. All right, got this all polished back up through 12,000 grit after putting on the CA finish. Now we're just going to hit it with a little bit of HUD Ultra Gloss. This just gives it that final sheen, final high glossy finish that this Amboynia Burl so rightfully deserves. Just buff it in, throw on the lathe, turn it up to about 2,000 RPM. Really work that compound in there. All right, then we go to a clean, fresh section of patch and we buff it off. And there we have it. So we get this pen put together. All right, got all my parts laid out for this barren fountain pen. I'm gonna get this going here. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to put on my clip assembly. I've got this uh, this dark section here. This is just a bark inclusion, but I wanna just cover that up with my clip. And you can see here that it'll actually cover up pretty nicely right there, just like that. If I can get my camera to focus, there we go. So it'll actually cover it up pretty nicely. So we're just gonna go ahead and cover that up with the clip. You'll still be able to see it underneath the clip if you angle it just right, but it won't be out looking like a uh, like a harsh scar or something on there. Hold that right there. And press that in and drive it home. All right, got a real nice fitment on there. Looks really nice. Right, next step we're going to take is we're going to put in our center bushing. And this is just going to slide in just like so. Center band, not center bushing, but that's okay. Now, as you're pressing this in, you can kind of see that plastic that kind of pressed outward right there. In order to clean that up, I just take a little pick and I just kind of push it out. Now, with some of the metal finishes, it'll actually press out the metal as well. So you got to kind of watch it as you press it in. The gold's pretty smooth, it doesn't usually do that, but uh, like the gun metal has a really high buildup amount of metal, and so you really got to watch it with the gun metal finishes. There we go, got that all cleaned out, we can just drive it home. Got a real nice fitment on there. It looks really good. So our next step is going to be putting on our bushing. Now, when I do a fountain pen, I like to make it so that you line up your pen nib point directly into the clip in order to drive it home. So you just drive it in like this. So I'm going to thread on my nib onto its bushing, just like so. And then I'm going to take my pen cap and I'm going to thread in my tip straight in See the point lined up with the clip, twist that in, and then I'm going to bring on my body of my pen, get my grain lined up, and 
and then kind of press that in just slightly thread that out unscrew our tip and then we'll thread that in just like so And now we can thread our tip back on. And you'll be able to see that when we bring those two together, thread that in, they line up beautifully. Gorgeous. So now we just take that back apart and we're gonna get our rear assembly together. We're gonna take our post cap, we're going to press that together. And we just press that in just like that. Press in our final piece here. We thread in our post cap, make sure that we don't forget our orientation. Thread in our tip. And that pen is complete. Gorgeous Amboynia Burl with gold baron pen. Absolutely love the fountain pen that's on these. Does have a nice sharp tip on it. Works really, really well. It's a really nice pen. That is one lucky customer getting that one. Not bad for a second attempt.